Hello everyone, hope we're all doing well. So today we're doing something completely different. Fortunately, I've not been able to get out this week due to a problem being with my car. So I've had to think of a new idea to keep the content going for the channel. So we're looking at today the Too Good To Go app. Um, I'm just first off, I'm not being sponsored by them and so I'm not getting paid in any kind of way. I've done it out my my own curiosity. And so yeah, let's begin. I've recently ordered from the Greggs, um, Too Good To Go. Um, and it was fantastic. I got um, pastries and um, sandwiches and stuff like that. If you don't know what the Too Good To Go app is, I'll let you know. The Too Good To Go app is an application that connects customers to restaurants and stores that have surplus unsold food. So all you need to do is download the app onto your Android or um, iPhone device and just go on there, select what the area where you live, obviously create an account as well, and just find a store or a restaurant and scroll through. You can have, you have a choice of how many bags you'd like as well, and they can range from literally pennies, or well, I think I think the minimum is a pound, and up to whatever they what they ever they want to charge you. Yeah. But normally they're, they're, they're no more than five six pound, and then yeah. Or place that order and then go and collect it at the, the time it tells you along the bottom. So, what I did the other night was I saw um, on YouTube, I saw a video of the Pizza Express Too Good To Eat and it looked fantastic. I saw people getting pasta, pizzas, dough balls, desserts, all in just one bag. So I thought, do you know what? I'm going to order it. So today we're going to have a look at what's happened is so the first night I tried to order, unfortunately my order got cancelled, which sometimes it does if they haven't got any surplus food. So the second night I've ordered again, got cancelled again. Third night, as you can see, it's been cancelled again. We're up to the fourth time we're ordering now and we've got half an hour to wait. It's still not being cancelled, so let's hope it doesn't get cancelled. And we're going to go down there now and Go and hopefully go and collect the order. So come with me and we'll, yeah, have a look. So, we're finally here. Um, just outside of the Pizza Express. Just going to wait about five, five or ten minutes. Uh, just going to wait for that countdown on the app to finally reach zero. Then we can go inside and go and collect it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take the bag and show you the bag and we'll go home and have a look what's inside so i'll see you back at home bye so i've just got home got my bag here let's have a look inside there is three items in here the first one is let's have a quick look is a chocolate cake. I don't know if you can see that without me actually spilling. Let's have a look. That's, there we go. Hope you can see that well on there. Well, let's have a look what else is in there. It's probably another cake. Have a look. Again, another chocolate cake. They do look quite nice cakes actually. Um, I think if you do order them from um, Pizza Express, they do come with ice cream. I might be wrong there, but obviously I don't expect them to come with ice cream now, but yeah. And finally, we've got... This one's very doughy. Dough balls? Dough balls, yeah. These are... I'll have a quick look at these. Um, They are just plain dollar balls. So let's have a quick look at how much they normally are in the the restaurant. So let's we'll have a quick look on the website. The dough balls um, come with uh, garlic butter, um, and they are five ninety five each. This probably looks like two portions, so yeah, five ninety five each on them. The chocolate cake that I did show you earlier. Um, they are uh, 7 95 each. 
So yeah, we have made a saving on there. I'll put that on there because I can't think of the maths right now because it is quite late at night. Overall, um, I maybe was expecting a little bit more um, due to the cancellations, the amount of cancellations I had, which was a total of three. Uh, this was my fourth uh, attempt to try and get the Pizza Express one. Would I order again? Probably, yeah. Probably would, yeah. Um, I'm, I'm not being sponsored by uh, Too Good To Go in any kind of way, but I've had some really good Too Good To Go bags. Um, I'll show you on the screen now. One, one of them I had the other week was at uh, the Morrison's Daily. And yeah, I got a really good one. I also ordered from Morrison's a hot food counter as well. I, I haven't taken a picture of that one, but we ended up getting like a turkey dinner that they got an offer at the minute. And it was really, really nice. And also there was some left from a breakfast in there as well. So we've got quite a bit. Um, um, we've also got Greg's in the past, which I've had plenty of stuff in there, uh, like pastries and stuff like that. So yeah, I would highly recommend using the app. Um, you can also use it for, um, like sometimes you get obviously your pastries and sandwiches and things like that. You can use them the next day and take them to work with you. Um, or for days out so yeah i'll give it a thumbs up uh well not not particularly this one but normally too good to go yeah really really good um just want to say thanks for watching the video remember to like comment subscribe it really does mean the world to me and let me know what you think to your too good to go in your local area you might have fantastic ones and you've ordered from pizza express and have had absolutely loads there but yeah let me know in the comments, but thanks for watching. Bye.